In this video, we're going to complete example two on bearings. It says a helicopter leaves its starting point O. That's the name of our starting point. O, by the way, stands for origin. Origin is basically a word which means starting point. Anyway, it then travels on a bearing of 145 degrees for 70 kilometers. Now, before we even finish reading the question, quite often I want to start drawing straight away. I really want to visualize what's going on. So I'm going to put my starting point down and I'm going to label it with an O. And I need to go on a bearing of 145 degrees. In order to do that, I need my compass. So I'm going to bring my compass over such that the center of my compass lies over the point. Remembering that true bearings are measured from north. So I've got to color in my north arrow. And I know that if I go towards east, that it's a 90 degree angle, a right angle. But I need a 145 degree angle. So I'm going to go another 55 degrees. The reason for that is 90 degrees plus 55 degrees equals 145 degrees. Okay. Now I'm going to travel in this direction for 70 kilometers. So I'm going to draw a nice long line here. And I'm going to say that this line, I'll have an endpoint, that this line is 70 kilometers long in real life. Now, finishing off the question, it says, how far east has the helicopter traveled from its starting point? What we need to do here is we need to draw a right angle triangle. And this is key for working out these questions. Get the right angle triangle drawn first and then try and solve it. So I'm going to draw my right angle triangle like so. I have a line coming across, a line coming down, and I'll show that it's a right angle. Now I've got enough information to solve my problem. In fact, I'm going to rub out some other markings around my triangle so that it's clearer. I'm even going to get rid of the compass. I don't need it anymore. Here's my right angle triangle. Now, what side am I trying to find? Well, I'm actually trying to find this side because this, the side I've just labeled X is the side that goes in the easterly direction. The question says, how far east has the helicopter traveled? Okay, let's solve it. Let's start by labeling our triangle. Opposite our right angle is our hypotenuse at 70 kilometers. Our marked angle of 55 degrees has a side opposite that. And then finally, we have our adjacent which is x. Now we don't need our opposite because there's no x, there's no 70, there's no number or anything there. So we're using a or adjacent and h or hypotenuse. So we'll write down our acronym so ka toa like so. And because we're using adjacent and hypotenuse, adjacent and hypotenuse, we must be using the middle part of our acronym. So we're actually using cos. We'll write that down cos and then always your angle next. So 55 degrees equals and then the vinculum bar. So we just need to figure out what number, what goes at the top of the fraction and, and what goes at the bottom of the fraction. Going back to our acronym, after C comes A and then H is last. So uh, A for adjacent was X, so that must go at the top of the fraction. H was last, hypotenuse was 70, so 70 goes at the bottom of the fraction. Now, if you have a number at the bottom, you do what's called a slide. You slide the 70 to the front, giving us 70 times cos of 55 degrees equals x. Now all we need is our calculator. 70 times cos of 55 degrees equals, and we get 40.15. Now, it hasn't told us how many decimal points we should be doing this to. Um, no, so let's just do it to the nearest whole number. Let's just say 40 kilometers. X equals 40 kilometers. And next to it, I'm just going to write 0 dp, which just means I'm doing it to zero decimal places, meaning I'm not going to have any decimal points after my number. Now, because this question was a written question, it would be nice to give a written solution. So we could just say that the helicopter has traveled 40 kilometers east of its starting point. Anyway, that concludes our video on example two. Remember to read the description below for links to work booklets that relate to this video.